Hey guys, it's Mary, and exhausted, exhausted Mary, back with um, my weekly Raw video vlog. Um, so let's just get straight to it. Monday Night Raw was last night, and following a Shane McMahon return, it wasn't as good as um, the week before. And I don't really think they could have tried or done anything to make it better. Although The Undertaker was on last night and he was advertised for the show and they were making a big deal and hyping him up. But he basically came out and said one line and then he left. And it was kind of like this. So Undertaker grabbed Vince by the throat after Vince was basically trying to be like, I control the Undertaker, and he told him that once the door to the cell closes, he knows what he does, and the blood of his son is going to be on his hands. So Shane's blood's going to be on Vince's hands from what the Undertaker does to him in Hell in a Cell. So the match looks like it's on. Um... I don't know. It was kind of underwhelming. Thought it would have been uh, something else. I just don't know where they're going with this or who's going to win. Um, March 15th, they're both booked. Shane and The Undertaker are booked for Raw. So, and Shane's going to be on next week. So hopefully we'll get somewhere in the next uh, couple weeks leading up to WrestleMania. Um, Stephanie McMahon cut a promo last night basically in response to Shane coming back um, for the Achievement Award she was supposed to win. And um, I think she cut the best promo of her whole entire career. She killed it. She nailed it. It was really, really good. And um, she was probably the highlight of the show. Um, Triple H first Dean Ambrose. Yeah. Well, Roman was off TV because um, he got no surgery. S no surgery. Um, so Dean decided to take his place and um, demanded a championship title match and it's kind of weird because he's lost a whole bunch of times they were saying that on busted open today so he got rewarded with a you know why should he get rewarded with a title match but um trip said he would tell him the response later in the night dean got his butt kicked and then trips beat the crap out of dean if trips can beat the crap out of somebody every week going into wrestlemania that would be great he he's nailing the heel role and he was very good in the opening promo on Roman Reigns and he's putting question in mind but now there's a championship match between Dean and Triple H at uh, Roadblock which is a live event that's taking place on the 12th and it's for the heavyweight title so I don't know I don't think Dean's gonna win but like I feel like this whole thing's heading towards a fatal four-way at WrestleMania as opposed to a singles match because I think they are suddenly realizing again that they shouldn't have put Roman Reigns in this position and Dean's way over and if Dean does win then where is Brock gonna go and where is Reigns gonna go I, like it, it's just it seems like it's leading to a fatal four-way at WrestleMania for the title which is probably gonna happen because they keep changing the main event of WrestleMania it's turning into a trend so we'll see um other than that nothing really crazy happened Hopefully next week will be better, but things that make you go, hmm, Big Show and Kevin Owens, um, Dolph Ziggler and The Miz, Brie Bella and Lana, who doesn't even wrestle, Rusev supposedly doing a power slam competition and it doesn't happen, he ends up in a tag team match on Raw. It's like a month to WrestleMania. Is this what's going to be on our card? Like, there's no hype behind it. Like, I mean, the three main matches are made and people aren't happy with Shane McMahon versus Undertaker. So, I just... I don't know. I big Sh Kevin Owens in a match with Big Show and, like, I get the Chris Jericho, AJ Styles tag team. Hopefully it, like, implodes. But I really think that AJ should be fighting KO for the Intercontinental Championship because they were alluding to that and then they stopped. So, yeah, it was a mediocre Raw. Um... Follow me on Twitter at Mayor underscore Bear. Follow Busted Open at Busted Open Radio. 
um, follow us on Facebook, follow us on Instagram, follow us on YouTube, go to bustedopennation.com. That's what you should be on. We're going to be live at WrestleMania 32 in Dallas, Texas. Uh, next week when I have it all written down with all the dates, they're going to be there from Friday to Monday. So make sure you guys check them out. Uh, Fishbone Grill. And then there is another one. Uh, make sure you check them out. I will get the, all the information, but it will be up on the website soon. So you'll have all the information there. Um, and that's it until next week. Hopefully we'll have a crazier wall review next week. Have a good night, guys. Thanks.